production, and we don't even have a cast. We're here to pick the cast, right now. It should have been done last month. Uh, we are burning through our budget. Has anyone read the script? It is unfilmable and shockingly R-rated. What script? Oh my god, Dennis, what have you done? Is that your fanfic? Oh, and to Zeus Ray, I did not fix Snitch. I deleted it. He did, and that triggered the Dennis Redundancy Program. Oh no, the Dennis Redundancy Program! Wait, what? Everything you delete is backed up and sent to most of home base. You delete a lot of super critical data. We honestly thought you were a spy for a while, but... Uh, yeah, no. I'm ruined! Seabot, throw me in the ocean! I am Seabot! Find in the sea, whatever! Everyone calm down. No! We cannot function with this much chaos on set. Commander, I have a friend who can help. Let's go find him. Hey, what's up, guys? Back with another lit video, and today we are going to be going over the Eddie quest in, of course, the Beyond the Stellar Horizon event, which help Azalea find everything she needs to rebuild Eddie. Collect Eddie parts in industrial zone. So, of course, we need to go into an industrial zone. We have to find 30 of them. So let's hope we could do this in one mission. If if not, then if you guys can do it in one mission, comment down below. But yeah, we're gonna try to do this in one mission and see if we can. So I will see you guys in the mission. The further we travel from the storm shield, the worse the visibility gets. But I have a solution. Time to boost our visibility. You have 20 minutes to build three towers. You can build any three towers you want. I've marked the location of the towers on your map. You may want to collect resources before starting to build. strange where are you i've started a new life where no one will ever find me hey what's with this upside down bucket on the floor occupied captain clark did you read my fanfic no can you promise to never ever 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 read it help me rebuild my friend and you have my word this is gonna be strange to hear coming from me but i don't think throwing another robot at the problem will fix anything eddie wasn't created to act he was built to keep deep space crews from killing each other. Really? The team that developed Eddie were fans of the show, so they gave us an Eddie of our own. He was the only thing that kept the cast sane. There's his head. I'll start the personality transfer. seem to be just ahead. Is this okay with everyone? Eds, it's Captain Clark. We're looking for the rest of your body now. That's wonderful to hear. I don't know if this will help your search, but normally it's found just below my head. Thank you, Eds. Oh, look, my leg. I missed you, Eds. I'm sorry I've been missed. Did you miss me? I think you'd like me to say yes. So for sure, yes. Was that correct? I'll take it. More me. Very exciting. Is there anything I should know about as I come online? Yes. The world has been taken over by storm monsters. Do we like them? No, they're storm monsters. I'm sure they're just misunderstood. We are now up to four legs. I'm supposed to have two legs. But maybe legs three and four know something I don't. We'll just go with two. All good options. Eddie, I need you to understand something. Then I will understand that thing. The monsters are bad. No one is truly bad. You just need to see things from their perspective. They want to destroy humans. 
You are quite frustrating. Eddie, you need to take sides on this one issue. I am not programmed to take sides. I am programmed to see all sides. Although, is that not a flawed approach? Then again, who am I to question my own programming? And what's more, who am I to believe my own programming to be sacred? Let's give him a minute. I can't look to myself for the answer. I am built to guide decision making, not make decisions. But who else can I look to? Captain Clark? I think I have come to a conclusion. And what have you decided? I'd like to arrange a debate where both sides are represented. You want to arrange a husk slash human debate? It's the only way to come to an informed decision. Have you looked outside? Yes. Have you looked inside? It's radiating life and love. And that's not very fair to the husks now, is it? And there you guys have it. We have just completed that quest of the Beyond the Stellar Horizon event, which is Eddie. We have found Eddie. We also got 250 summer tickets, <coughs> which is awesome for the new llamas that are coming out or already out. <coughs> so I actually will be doing a video on the llamas soon if you guys do want to see that. If you do want to see it, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, for when I do upload it and for the rest of this quest event of me actually uh, Completing the rest and showed you guys how to do the quest. So I will see you guys in the next one. Peace to the first and hopefully last Husk human debate. I am your moderator Ray taking the position don't annihilate humanity is Ken Can you have the floor? Home base madam moderator I implore you to conclude that debating with monsters is both dumb and stupid. Furthermore, it interferes with my monster fighting time, which is both awesome and fun. I yield back the balance of my time. Taking the position, love hurt people also baseball, this tool over here. Can you have a chance to respond? No. We now open the floor to questions. Ken. How do you respond to claims that you and Homebase must be destroyed? With throwing stars. You two do not make it easy. He wants to destroy, and yet, he wants to not be destroyed. I never thought I'd say this, but I think we may have to... agree to disagree? Oh dear.